What's up everybody, it's Trent with TNT Costuming and Prompts back with another tutorial. Today we are doing armor. Uh, we're going to go over a couple of cheap ways you can make your armor for your stormtrooper, uh, clone trooper, um, that sort of thing. Um, these are fairly easy, very low budget, um, great for a costume party, um, great for a fan film, uh, not quite up to the standards of some of the costuming sites, uh, 501st, Rebel Legion, things of that nature won't more than likely will not accept uh, this method uh, or these costumes for their sites, but it's great for a lot of other uh, means. Like I said, it is low budget. Um, so we're going to go ahead and get started. For the most rigid the most rigid parts of the armor, one thing we like to use that's relatively inexpensive is uh, foam board. Um, you can actually see a piece I have here. Uh, starting out with this is, is uh, going to be a Biker Scout uh, outfit, actually. So to get an idea of how that's going to look, I'll have my uh, lovely wife here model it. Let's get that. Just kind of pull it around your sides a little bit. You want to scoot? Okay, so you can see that that's the top half there. So as you can see, that is the top part, the chest piece um, for the Biker Scout. It obviously has an, a lower piece um, for the Cumberbund. I don't actually have a picture of it handy. I've got a little toy. I don't know how well you'll be able to see this. Uh, but anyway, that top part of the vest, that's kind of the look we're going for right now. Um, the bottom part is cloth. Uh, you know, we'll eventually have tutorials for the whole armor up there um, and then I've got another piece of armor that I'm working on right now which actually utilizes some um, placemats uh, these are a little flimsier um, I'll, I'll move into that tutorial uh, here in a minute just wanted to give a quick intro as to uh, the foam board and uh, anyway foam board you can get at any craft store you're looking to spend uh, just a couple of bucks for a big piece. A big piece will usually get you your chest armor um, front and back and then you could uh, get a couple more pieces for the legs and arms and things. So we'll go into a little more detail on um, how you would work with that stuff um, in part two. <laughs> 